In 2016, Assistant Director Sean Wolf and professors at the American Institute of Language and Culture conducted a study and concluded that one sector of growth is the creation of universal documentation to determine students' needs, goals, and progress. Wolf also commented on the teacher's toolkit on SCS and how it supports assessment and planning and allows teachers to present ideas for specific learning goals for groups or individuals. Elizabeth Pollan, an English language teacher at the Institute, said SSE helps us assess the strengths and weaknesses of different textbooks. What I really like is the opportunity to choose skills grammar, listening, speaking and get statements about the skills, about the learning objectives that each learner needs to advance to the next level. She said, in this era of global hyper-competitiveness, the challenge for any language program is to find innovative ways to succeed while remaining true to its identity. The school's English teachers were also impressed with GSE's capabilities. There are also several part-time English-speaking students from the local community. There are also 221 international students from 59 different countries, of which China, Albania, Brazil, Japan, Morocco and Nigeria are the most represented countries on campus. The university offers an intensive English language program. This standardization means that the curriculum can easily adapt it or redesign to meet students' needs in a short period of time. In Salem, officials have determined that GSE is the ideal tool for a modern, evidence-based approach that continuously stimulates research, discussion and innovation. It provides students, teachers, and administrators with a truly comprehensive measurement tool that allows them to set and measure goals and go beyond the usual. Joni Hagages, one of the teachers, believed that the GSE was an excellent tool for monitoring student performance. The biggest challenge was that we needed a better way to accommodate students, Wolf said.